What's up ladies, my name is Patricia and welcome to my channel. So today I'm coming to you guys with a diaper bag collection video. I hope it's helpful for you guys. I wanna start off by saying that all the links to these bags will be down below or any similar styles that are currently on the market. So if you're new to my channel, my name is Patricia. I am now a mama of two. I haven't yet come to you guys and introduced baby boy to you, but um, I will do that. So I have one little one right now. Um, he is nine weeks old and then I also have a toddler who's a little over two. So that's just a reference point. So I am packing for two, so I do need a little bit of a bigger bag, but I'll get into the details in just a second. First, I wanna say that it's likely that you'll have two bags i think that's what works for me a bigger style and then a style that's smaller for quick outings so if you find that one doesn't kind of fit all of your needs then you might have to invest in a second diaper bag so i have four to share with you guys today three are currently in my collection and then i have one unboxing to share with you guys so stay tuned till the end i do have diaper bags that are not included in this video that either are no longer in my collection or i didn't find them practical for daily use the first diaper bag that i want to talk about is the diaper bag that i'm actually currently using and that is this one right here it's this bag and it is from freshly picked this is the leopard classic city backpack and i really like this one it's interesting because i really didn't see myself initially as a backpack type of mama but now that i have two that has changed <laughs> all right i need my hands and so this is the one that i have been reaching for the most right now i like the material on the outside very easy to clean the leopard print i really like i picked this up from bed bath and beyond uh i'm not too sure if it's still still there but you can pick this up for sure on freshly picks website you can also pick freshly pick <laughs> you can also pick this up at um nordstrom's but i don't know if they have this particular style but they definitely have uh, the brand so I will open it up for you guys I actually wasn't really prepared to do this but let me just open it so you guys can see well first of all let's go on the outside so the outside we have two pockets here on the outside one in the front the one that's here I know for sure I have wipes in and they're the water wipes no these are Huggies natural care I thought I had water wipes in here but I think I have water wipes on the inside two on the outside and this is what it looks like on the inside this is what i got in here so far so i have some diapers for baby girl some diapers for baby boy i have the water wipes in here my aquaphor so this is not a what's in my bag if you want to know what i keep in my bag i'll leave that up in the cards i will say that's when i just had baby girl so i might need to do an updated version of that um, but it has a pocket back here it has um a changing pad zip right here um, it has insulated pockets on the sides and um, some pockets here up front i should also mention that there are two pockets in the back i know i for sure i have some hand sanitizer uh, on this side and I can't remember what's on this side. I like I like it. I feel like it's stylish looking and it's something that I could continue to wear myself even after the kiddos. So I really, really like this bag. Like I said, it's the one that I'm currently in right now. The next one is not quite a diaper bag, but I'm using it as a diaper bag. This is the one that I featured in the What's In My Diaper Bag video and it is this right here the long uh champ uh, le pliage and 
Uh, this is, I, I, I can't remember what style this is, but it's discontinued, it's from 2014. I bought it on Poshmark. I loved the pink and the white, so it's gonna be hard to find this specific style, but they have a pink style in their latest spring collection. If I can find a picture of it, I'll put it on the screen that I think is really cute. It is pink on pink, um, and I think it's great. This is the large size. And I actually don't know what is in here. I know I have, okay. So I did use this for a little road trip that my family and I did recently. So we had a little road trip, a couple of hours from here. And so I took this bag instead because it's bigger. And I actually like to travel with bags that I can kind of open wide in the car so I can see everything that's in it as opposed to using a backpack. So this also was the bag that I was using prior to baby boy's arrival when I just had baby girl. Um, and so I'm gonna do a travel video like how to travel with littles. I've done quite, I've done a cruise with baby girl, multiple flights, international, domestic. I really wanna do a video on that because I know that when I was preparing to travel with her, I was doing a whole lot of research and now I've traveled with baby boy. I mean, of course it was like only, a, it was a four hour drive. So yeah, anyway, yes, we, we're gonna work on that. But for right now, um, bags that you can open wide in a car, yes. And as you can see, I do have an organizer in here. Uh, you need that for this bag because it's just a big hole. So yeah, I love these bags too. Again, you can keep this way after your kiddos are little. I think this bag is oh so cute. You might have one already in your collection if you're a bag girl like me. So you might wanna whip it out and use it as a diaper bag while you have littles. And yes, I think this is a great um, every day if you're the type of person that likes to carry um, you know, everything in the kitchen sink. But definitely for your longer outings, you might want something bigger like this that can carry more things. I'll also leave a link to the bag organizer that I use from Amazon down below too if you have uh, this bag and you want to keep it nice and organized. So yeah, my long shop lip viage is uh, diaper bag number two. Diaper bag number three, I'll be honest with you, I don't know where it is. It's the one that... Um, my husband actually likes to use the most. Uh, I like to use the least at this point because it's very small. Um, and that is the Dagny Dover Indie Backpack. I have it in the size small in the color Pinto. So I'll put that on the screen. Uh, if, you're, if you follow my channel, you know that I actually did a review and unboxing of this particular diaper bag. Also, I packed it up in that video too, so you might want to check that video out if you're interested in that diaper bag. I've had it, I think, for a couple of years. I think that video is at least two years old now, maybe. So check that out. I like that, again, for short, quick outings. Now that I have two, or when I had one, now that I have two, it's a little small for that. But... I'm holding on to it because I have a feeling that once my littles get a little older and I'm not caring as much for them, um, I'll go back to using that bag. You guys, I've done several Dagny Dover videos. You guys know that I love them for work bags, for all types of bags. Um, and so I like the Indie Backpack. It comes in a small, medium, and a large size. Consider it in the medium. If you're looking for a standard size, uh, you know, everyday diaper bag. That's it, I have just three. That's Those are the three that are in my collection right now. We're gonna move on to the unboxing. So this is a diaper bag from Luli Bebe. I don't know if that's how you pronounce it. I'm just putting a little twist on it, but that's how I'm pronouncing it. Luli Bebe, 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 right? And um, I really, listen, I've been looking at them from a distance. A friend of mine had um, suggested their bags when I was pregnant with baby girl. I always had them in the back of my mind. I would go to their website every once in a while. Anyway, they reached out to me on Instagram. I was like, hey, we would love to send you one of our bags. And I was like, um, yes. So this is it. We're gonna open it together. 
is the bag here. It's a big bag. Okay. Let's reach in. There it is. Luli Bebe. All right, y'all. Let's open it up. Ooh, let's turn it around. Ooh. Okay. Here we go. So we got a tag back here. Sophisticated, sleek, and luxurious. A fashionable companion for modern mama. Yes. So I believe this is their classic style. Let's give it some love. Let's give it some love so we can see her in all her glory. And there she is. I like her. She cute. She is cute. So this is their Monaco diaper bag and the color is latte brown. There she is. Can y'all see? Yes. So she is a backpack. Got this big pocket here in the front. Got some packaging over there. Let's look at the back. We have some straps here in the back. Some pockets. These are pretty generous pockets here on the sides. So a bottle, a water bottle, and also a you know, baby bottle can definitely fit in there. Um, let's open the inside up. Okay, so interesting choice of interior in here it's kind of like a silky more luxurious material i'm curious to how this cleans up um let's see we have a changing pad in here stroller hooks i see those here on the tops on the sides so i hook that onto the stroller and then we have a what looks like a crossbody strap inside we have a um zipper back here and then we have one, two, three, four pockets on the inside. I should say that this bag is huge. Um, it's notably bigger on the inside than my freshly picked one. I say that I can see everything in there pretty well for a backpack. Um, so this is kind of like a mixture between the tote that I use and then the backpack, which is, I think will serve me pretty, pretty well for sort of longer outings or maybe when we do like theme parks, like we start going to theme parks or festivals or things like that when I need to carry more, but I also need to carry it on my back. I, I like this one, guys. The only thing that I'm used to that uh, I might miss are the pockets in the back my Dagny Dover and also the freshly picked have pockets in the back um, the only thing that I would say that I'm worried about is that interior I'd have to do more research to see how to clean that um, but other than that it's very stylish looking another bag that I can continue to use even after babies I might have to go ahead and move into this one and out of my freshly picked for a while so shout out to Luli Bebe for um, sending me over this bag. So for you mamas out there, what diaper bag are you using and um, why? What do you like about it? Are you more of a tote girl? Are you more of a backpack girl? Why or why not? I could say I was very anti-backpack originally. You know, I'm more of a girly girl. What I can say is these are very feminine styles, especially this one, very feminine and of course, the leopard one more time if you're interested in any of the ones that i shared i'll leave links down below again share with me what you have been liking also down below if you're interested in luli bebe's monaco uh, diaper bag that i will leave a link down below where you can get 25 percent off yes y'all that's all that i have for you guys today i love you guys so much Thank you for watching my video and visiting me today. I'll see you guys very soon with another one. And as always, God bless you.